Either I take the low road or I take the high road. with a needle and thread, you know. Fine. Please don't put me through that again. Not your house. Jack. What did he do? Voice of the occupation authority on the radio, wasn't he? We got here. Out 
to come out wherever you are. And now it's time for famous rips. How on earth did he get to be Uncle Jack? Everybody likes him, except you. Have they forgotten what he did? People are forgetting a lot of things now. Oh, I suppose they don't even know what he did to you. But how did they forget who it was on the German radio every night during the occupation? They locked him up after the victory. People don't talk about the past anymore. When did they let him out? You've forgotten things too, you know. Patience, Ollie. Been a while, hasn't it? Watch. Our own wee panic burn. But it's all up there. They don't need a cook. They need a maid. Where's the bloody parade balloon? You could hide the Tsar and all his relations up here and no one's the wiser. Time to get the float out of here. Holly. I said float. What did you think I said? We didn't come here for the float. We came here to get into the Motoline tunnels. <laughs> How do we gang out of here? When you have eliminated the impossible, whatever remains, however improbable, must be the truth. You want me like Santa Claus after he's eaten up all the biscuits? Didn't you read the plans? There's a secret passage and a hatch. There was a hatch here. I hope it really does go to the tunnel to Apple Home.
We haven't been in the parade in a while, have we, Margaret? I hope the executive committee listens. I hope they're willing to tell people the truth. Don't forget to get some hydrogen for your float, in case it doesn't go well in the broadcast tower. I hope you're wrong, Margaret. No one seems to live here anymore. Might be a good place to camp out. What happened here? Sin no more. You never liked me, did you? No, I can't just not look at the telly. They put one in every bloody corner. I'll tell you what I can do. I can blow up the bloody broadcast antenna at City Hall. That is the worst idea I've ever heard from you. What do you know? You're dead. Huh? I've got an answer for that, have you? Margaret. Margaret. Ah. Looks like a plague whistle did a number on this. Take your medicine! You can't deny it! Allow me to cheer you up! You did it! You can't deny it! There's the 
one left to look out. He's about to start fighting people. Who's that? Ah, the Department of Senseless Idiotic Research. If anywhere's got hydrogen, it's these bam pots. If not, I'm off to the executive committee to fill a bag with hot fucking air. Where do they keep their hydrogen, do you think? There's my hydrogen. Now, I just need to walk out the door and... We have an intruder! I'm shutting all the doors! Ah, oh, for fuck's sake! How do I get out now? Uh, up here, Ollie. I think you can open up the doors from the office. Well, how the hell do I do that? I can't even fly up there, can I? Oh, wait, the cannon. Just need to make sure it's facing the tower and wind it up. That's a terrible idea.
just get in. I hope this doesn't tear off any bits you'll miss later. Why did you mention that before? Still got all my bits. They just hurt extraordinarily much. Who needs trains and planes? We ought to send the mail by cannon. All right, all right. I I've opened the door. Now please, just go. Thank you kindly. I'm going to have the worst headache for the rest of the week. Right, that can't be. You can't hide from me. <coughs> and St. George. The broadcast tower can't be that far from here. I wonder what the executive committee... It is up to right now. must be up these stairs. And it's another fabulous day in Wellington Wells. The weather is a bit wet, but that's the lovely thing about English weather. The sun always comes out in the end, so come on out or you'll miss it. Wakey, wakey, everyone. Good morning to you. Good morning to you. Ooh. Get past Head Mill the job. I better shut her down Do first. Where have they hidden her control? Please step away immediately. You are not authorized. Please clear the area immediately. Please step away immediately.
if people couldn't find them. People are a lot worse at finding things than you might think. My husband could never find them. Oh, you are not authorized. Please clear the area immediately. Please step away immediately. Please step away immediately. Get what's coming to us in the end. Where do I turn on the bloody power to the elevator? danger at all. <laughs> I simply love your idea about the joy pills in the, the elevator shuttered. Could you open it? I'm so sorry. I'm in a bit of a jam. Would you mind asking one of my colleagues? Ah, there we go. And up I go. Good Christ, it's all going down the crapper. You don't have to talk like that. Is someone there? Who's in charge here? You're in luck. It's me today. We rotate the dread responsibility. Do I know you? So, there's only one of you who doesn't take joy on a day? I might have had a little. <laughs> the tanks in the military camp. Did you know they made a papier mache? Oh, that's terrible. Would you like a joy? Have you been getting out into the village lately? People are getting a bit slim. And these charts. Here, let me get you another joy. We've got our own booth. The executive committee? So, you people are in charge of the whole shebang? That's us. Ever since the victory, what's wrong with the tanks? You know what? I've forgotten. Oh, good. Well, come back if you remember, but with any luck you won't. <laughs> Be seeing you. We have to tell people. They need to make a new executive committee. <laughs> Absolutely. If they won't heed the loony from the garden district, they're sure to hark into the dead girl in his head. They'd listen to Uncle Jack. You know what that man did. 
Everyone listens to him. All day long. I can't stand his smirking face. Ollie. You're right. You're always right. But it's not going to be pretty. If we go upstairs, we're going to make all the truth about bloody everything. What was that? Hello? Yoo-hoo! Hello? Here's Ollie! Hello? Time to pay the piper, Jack. Where is he? Good Christ! He's gone off! He can't have gone off! I've got things to tell you, Jack! It's his last show. How'd you ken that? The, the camera's sm- No! I can't leave here until everyone knows the truth. Let's see what Jack has to say for himself. Hmm. I'm sure I had it right here. Uh, you know, there are times a little too much joy. Yes. Hmm. Here it is. Um, Mrs. Florence Gilbert of Bro is holding an exhibition of her hand-knit dolls. Well, she likes to make dolls from all over the world, all knitted in wool. It's his last you show. How'd you ken that? Spanish the camera's doll. smashed. They couldn't have shot another. Do you know who'd have liked that? Margaret, yeah. Why is he talking about you? Who's Margaret? Because hmm? I love dolls. <laughs> what am I talking about? Who cares about the past? Well, listen. Do drop by to Dee Dee's fabulous dolls at Mrs. Florence Gilbert's. Poor thing. Poor thing? She loved dolls, you know. She had dozens of them. They're from all over. I can assure you that there's absolutely no truth to the silly rumor that the food is running out. How does he know about your dolls? However, it is true that there's a brand new flavor of joy. You think a twelve-year daughter would be over dolls? His daughter? Yes, Ollie. But she'd make these darling little costumes. I knew it was wrong. Uh, I mean... God, she was even excited about going to Germany. It was me! I couldn't imagine living without her, so... So I hid her. Someone tipped them off. And she ran. No, that's not right. It was Jack what turned you in and I what tried to save you. No, Ollie. You turned me in. I'm afraid we've come to the end of our time. But you were my daughter. Jack Worthing. Margaret I mean it. Worthing. You're Ollie Starkey. No, I... I could never have betrayed you. You're my neighbor. I was your neighbor. How could I? How could I do a thing like that to a little girl? Dear God. Dear God. I'm sorry, Margaret. I never meant to hurt you. It's a bit late for an apology. Well, tell me. Do you hear me? We've come to the end of our time. Let's run out. 
We're all going to starve to death. You have to stop taking your joy. Take it from Jack. That's me. People have to know. But Jack's your father. Stop. That Jack's gone. That the food's run out. Oh. Have to stop. That they have to stop. stop taking the joy. Stop it. You have to broadcast the tape. Right, right. I could do that, but you won't, will you? God, God, I never meant to hurt you, Margaret. I'm sorry. Away. They've cut the power! The bastards! There's an emergency... one of those wheelie power thingy-mabobs. Watch out, someone's coming! Stop going away! Stop going away! Get away from that tape player! Someone's coming through the copper! We're running out of power! You hear me? Stop! We're back to the end of our time! Run out! Watch out! Someone's coming! You have to stop it! You have to stop it! That was... rather... The Bobby Popper! More I think them. we need to do the wheel again! The Bobby Popper! I won't have it! Lucky I don't believe in ghosts! Really takes it out of your shoulders. Come to the end of our We're running out of power. We've got to the end of our time. 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 Just walking out the front door is out of the question. Good thing I made you get that float. What do we do now? We say goodbye. To who? I'm not really your daughter. I know that. And I'm not really here. But... I'm a lie too. We've been together so many years. You don't think having an invisible friend is a wee bit babyish? 
for a man who's been to war. We can hide in the train station till it all blows over. Now that you've put that on the telly, I think it's time you put away childish things. You're right. You're always right. Goodbye, Margaret. All right, sir. I'd forgotten just how heinous a person I am. Well, the truth is not for everyone, sir. You see, some people find they are stronger than they ever supposed. Some people can let go of the confabulations that have comforted them. Some make choices that surprise even themselves. Perhaps these people are not you. Are you sure you don't wish to forget and go back? I was happy before, wasn't I? <laughs> 